Flow. Flow is a modern term for an ancient goal of many meditative practices. It represents a different state of consciousness where one is so absorbed in what is happening in the moment that time slows down, your senses and focus are heightened, and thinking often stops altogether. These moments can come whenever one is completely engaged in the present moment. The father of modern psychological research into flow, Dr. Cheek sent me high uses a metaphor of skiing to describe this special state. He states, imagine you are skiing down a slope and your full attention is focused on the movements of your body, the position of the skis, the air whistling in your face and the snow shrouded trees rushing by. There is no room in your awareness for conflicts or contradictions. You know that a distracting thought might get you buried face down in the snow. The run is so perfect you want it to last forever. Take a minute now and think about activities that have allowed you to naturally enter this flow state. It could be singing, dancing, making art, a good conversation, or any type of activity that allows you to get into the zone. If you love your job, it could even be the moment of closing a deal or performing a complicated task. Reflect on these moments as you have experienced them yourself already. Notice that in these moments of flow, many things about the way your mind works is different. Your experience of time is different. Your perceptual abilities seem heightened, and there is a harmony to the way in which each event unfolds naturally in awareness, in perfect attunement to the demands of the moment. Most athletes actually report a type of mental silence during this type of experience and sense a deeper intelligence flowing through them. This leads to an effortless quality to their actions which seem to happen spontaneously without forethought or contemplation, almost as if they are arising directly out of the moment itself. This experience of the zone is a powerful illustration of the meditative paradox of mental stillness leading to deep insight and skillful action. Here's an exercise. Bring to mind an experience of flow from your own life. What do you remember most about this experience? How was your awareness different from your normal state? How was your perception of time different? And perhaps most importantly, take a minute and reflect on how you can add more of these experiences into your life. The goal of meditation is a specific and unique state of meditative awareness. In this state, all of our experiences, inside and out, are perceived with full awareness as a moment-to-moment -moment flow, one discrete, spontaneous event in consciousness after another. This heightened state of meditative awareness, or presence, has many benefits and is discussed extensively in our online course. Much like an athlete in the zone, the quality of action that arises out of this meditative state of deep alignment with the present moment has a sense of effortlessness to it. With each part of the self working together in harmony and unison, responding perfectly to the demands of the current situation, and the intense presence and concentration characteristic of the flow state make it a good metaphor for the state of meditation itself. As you can see, meditation is much more than an exercise done for a few minutes a day on a cushion in silence and then set aside for the rest of life. If the insights and discoveries we make on the meditation cushion don't affect the way we live our lives, then they would have no real value. Ultimately, the qualities of presence, connection, and awareness 
that we develop in our meditation practice infuse and elevate our entire day so that our lives transform from a constant struggle to something much more like a beautiful and effortless flow. We welcome you to continue your exploration of the world of meditation by taking our online meditation course, which presents the concepts and techniques introduced here in greater detail. And we wish you wisdom and insight for your own meditative journey.